Hi, I'm Paweł Spechalski and today's short video will be about this thing. This thing on the HD OS 2 Fat Shark goggles, the power button. The, the goggles, the first generation of the goggles from the Fat Shark that have the power button. And yeah, I'm sarcastic, I'm really sarcastic about the whole thing. So yes, there is a power button which is called fan slash power. However, the goggles in the def by default are shipped with something that they call the legacy mode. When you plug the battery in, they power on immediately, so you cannot really control the power. The only thing that the button can do, if you press it long enough, yeah, they will start to make sound. Okay, and ultimately they will turn off the fan. And that's all. This is not really how you <laughs> call the button a power button. Because there is also something called a, the new mode, the different mode for the power button and the whole goggles to operate. And the, only this, changing the operational mode of the button, changes how the button behaves. On the more advanced goggle, there would be a, something like a mini in the settings to change turn this off and on, Fat Shark went in the slightly different way and to change how the goggles behave when you press the power button and when you connect the battery is changed in the hardware. You have to take the right cover and here next to the, to the connector over here, so let's focus over here, there is a small jumper. Yeah, the jumper like we used to see in the PCs from like 30 years ago. Nothing very fancy. It's not like it's something like a micro switch. They should have added a micro switch and the jumper. By default, the jumper jumps to backward spin. To change the operation mode of the button, you just have to take the jumper out and put it in the two front ones like this. Now, when you will cover this and connect the battery, nothing happens because the goggles go into the, the new, in my opinion, the correct mode. Now, to turn the goggles, you have to hold it for like a two seconds and then the goggles are operational. Single press, short press, enables and disables the fan, kinda useful, and by default the fan is enabled, so once again, kinda useful. And to power off the goggles, you just have to press the goggles slightly longer and they go off. Yes, in the new mode, the goggle drains some power from the battery, but those are really like micro amperes and if you do not intend to leave the battery connected for like a week or a month, nothing wrong will happen to the battery. If you are just having this connected on the field, nothing wrong comes of it. If you go home, then yeah, you should disconnect the plug from the goggles. But besides that, it's all. You do not have to jump, put it in, put it out, put it in, put it out when you are flying, when you are having fun with your FPV stuff. So um, the short tutorial for today is over. Until the next one. Bye bye.